in the foothills of Africa's fourth largest mountain. A group of Christian, Jewish, and Muslim coffee farmers affirmatively decided to marry peaceful interrelationships with economic development. Delicious peace grows in a Ugandan coffee bean tells their story. In the global world of commodities, coffee takes second place only to petroleum. We delight in the smell of the brew. We drink it to start the day when we meet friends. Yet as we hand our dollars to our vendors, we rarely think about the farmers who are our partners in supplying our caffeine libation. The farmers of Delicious Peace Coffee Co-op are a testament to this mutually beneficial relationship, which they have enhanced by adding the requirement of peace. Sorry, kid. Got to make room for the big boys. This party's too small for the both of us, Terry. Besides, you're not even real magic. News flash, Mickey. Clowns are creepy. Plus, I brought some Pepsi Max to keep the party banging. Or did you? The exotic dancers are here. And they brought Pepsi Max. Score. I love a man of taste. I heard that. Mama like. Dancers? Dancers. What kind of party is this? <laughs> yeah, I can see downtown from my office. And here you are in this basement, like some sort of little hermit. I don't want to talk about it. I don't think you're hearing me. You've got to be aggressive to make it in this business, dog. I kind of like it here. Case in point, these Doritos. See this thing here? This is stonewalling my taste for chips. Who's boss now, Clip? He's taking notes. Get off! 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 Get off!